Hello there, this is Rom Wills coming back at you with yet another couch video. Stay focused on the good women in your life. The good women. Now this is very important. Now, first of all, let me shout out Miss Mocha Angel. Miss Mocha Angel. Now, people who follow me a long time know I do some videos with her every now and then. And if you're not sure who she is, just do do a search through my archives. Look up Mocha Angel. Anyway, because uh, she was really, 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 really helpful during this time when I was going through the stroke, when I was in the hospital. She was going above and beyond uh, uh, what she was doing for me, despite having a 70-hour-a-week job. So um, I want to shout her out because she did she did a whole lot. I ain't going to get into everything, but she did a whole lot. She was just totally supportive. And I thought about her. I thought about a few, a few female friends who reached out to me. They were like, hey, Ron, you good? You need anything? Anything like that. And it wasn't all about romance. And see, I thought about that because I was like, you know what? Online... Too many dudes be too focused on these modern women, these 304s, all these women who uh, really ain't shit. Yeah, I'm going to say, y'all know I'm going on women. And when I do, I'm very careful to differentiate between good, positive women and women who ain't shit. Who ain't shit between grown women and little girls. And real quick, before I even go further, don't be one of those people that come on here, well, women don't pay attention to me. This ain't a sympathy channel. This is a channel for wolves. I just went through a stroke. I could be dead. I don't have time for anybody having some sad sack or feeling sorry for themselves and shit. I got thousands of videos telling you how to develop yourself into the type of man that a woman will find attractive. If, if Before, you need to like actually do the work. Do the fucking work. That's why I say talk about body game. That's why I talk about getting your mind right, getting on your mission, just doing what you can. So if you come on here and you like, well, women don't pay attention to me. Delete. Bach. Seriously, because I don't have time, especially going through a stroke, man. Especially going through a stroke, man. I don't have no sympathy for anybody, any man who's not going to fight. Any man who gives up, in fact, if you follow me, just unsub me. Seriously. This is a channel for wolves, wolves, men who are willing to fight for whatever. Seriously, either physical or whatever, they're willing to improve themselves. And not, for the even, not even for the women, let me be clear, not even for the women, for yourself, okay? Because if you get yourself right, oh, the women going to come. Hey, shit, you're going to get women you can't even, don't even want to deal with. You know, it'd be too many. You'd be like, damn, how I handle all of this? I handle all these women. So, anyway, like I said, shout out to Miss Mocha Angel, uh, especially. And then other some other lady friends and stuff who, you know, they say, hey, Rom, you okay? You need anything? Because there's plenty. Now, is it all the women? Hell to the no. But see, part of the problem is this, and this is why I say focus on the good women. Too often, it's too much to me dudes focusing on all these modern women, these bad women. Look, if you come across some woman on social media and say, well, a man can have a half a million for me. Now, you, that, that woman, that woman, she'll get a whole bunch of stuff. But why is she getting it? Because somebody thinks she's a baddie. Because I'm, I'm going to get into that baddie thing in a second. But somebody thinks she's fine and all of that. If a woman's saying you got to have 500000 or the 106 figures or you got to be a certain height, leave her the fuck alone. Because that, I'm going to tell you something now. Let's say you got all that stuff. Let me just give you some game here. You got all that stuff that women come along when some bad shit happens, when you go through a stroke or a heart attack or just a bad accident where you can't bring in that money or say you making that money and somehow like your business uh, goes out or something I'm going to talk about on my money channel. There's a lot of high, high six-figure uh, men and women, men, or we'll just say men, losing their jobs out here. 
there, there's a whole lot getting laid off. There's not enough talk about it. So if you lay it off and then that woman who got with you because you got six figures, all of a sudden you ain't making it no more. You think she going to hang around? I've seen that happen. Some guys thinking they, they doing all well and the woman all in them. In fact, I could call some names. All of a sudden they ain't doing it no more. The woman ready to go. Is that the woman you want? I'm going to tell you something now. Here's, here's a way you can really understand for women's good with you. Yeah, she with you in your good times, but she also supportive in your bad times. She going to be there for you. She going to make you a plate. She going to make you a plate. And when I say plate, I mean she going to make sure you eat. She going to make sure you well. She going to make sure everything good for your ass. And that's the important thing. Yeah, it's easy. Yeah, it's easy for people to be on your side when everything going well. And really, even beyond women. Which of your buddies are really there for you? Which of your buddies are really there for you? Who's who trying to help you? So, but it's focusing just on women. What woman is really, what woman is making sure you okay? You need some help. What can she do? She taking her time that she could be doing something else, even making some money, helping you. I want y'all to think about it. But see, a part of, I said I was going to say something about the baddies. A lot of motherfuckers looking for baddies. Let's be real. There's a lot of good women out there. But you know what? They ain't going, they ain't no Instagram baddie. But they ain't butt ugly either. Because I'm going to tell you something now. With a good woman, a good woman at least going to fix herself up to the best of her ability. Now, she might not be no dime or something like that. But she at least going to fix herself up to the best of her ability. So, first of all, look for that. Look, is she at least trying to fix herself up? Is she, you know, she's still trying to look good? Now, some woman trying to, you know, get a bunch of followers on IG or TikTok or, you know, getting a BBL or getting a ton of makeup on her face that just make her look totally different. She just going to fix herself up. She's going to be about some positive shit. And she looking at you for your character as much. Now, I know some dudes that say, well, ain't no women out here looking for care. Well, you apparently ain't meeting them. How come I'm meeting them? How am I meeting them? How am I meeting them? Because let's be real. If you talk about that six-figure thing, most women don't, ooh, my friend group don't know how much I make. You know, for some circumstances, she Miss Mocha Angel, shit. She just now finding out how much I actually make. And she was still supportive bunch of them so that's the thing though you know because a man with character always he always gonna work and i've told women this i said this on my woman's channel to the ladies i said she look for that guy who's trying to do some shit he always gonna make it he's gonna keep going and then even in his down times because the average millionaire is bankrupt three times he's gonna keep going now you got billionaires out there losing money what they do to come back and for any women listening, that's the type of man you want. And for the men, that's the type of woman you want. That woman, yeah, she with you in the good times, but then when you in the valleys, she the type going to ride with you. Ride or die. Good woman. And like I said, in most, well, no, all cases, every time I've known a good woman, they will at least fix themselves up. They ain't going to be out here looking all bummy or all of that. They're going to at least keep themselves clean, fix themselves up. You know, they will hit the gym. Are they going to be like that uh, super influencer? Maybe not. They don't need to be. First of all, and that's something with that too. Let me just go on a tangent real quick. There's only a few of those women any damn way. Bunch of guys going, we all, you know, there's always this talk about a shortage of men and all of that. There's really a shortage of women who will be falling in that bad category any damn way. So why are you worried about it? You want that woman who is in cooperation to your operation, going to keep herself fixed up, who going to help you as you're going through life, who going to be there for you good times and bad times. When you go through a stroke, accident, uh, shit, diabetics, diabetes, all of that, shit, that's the type of woman you want. Not just a woman who's with you while things are going good, because like I said, there's been too many men out there yeah, they had all the women all going crazy on when everything was going good, but then as soon as some shit happened, they they uh the women are gone. Or they find out the or they have a my bad situation. 
And I always say it jokingly, but this will be some real shit. Find out that woman they thought was down for him is fucking some broke ass motherfucker. Nah, you want to be, you want that woman who good for you, who shows she down for your program, who going to support you, who wants you for your character, who going to be there whether you're making a million or whether you're making 10000 And yeah, you get some women out there, oh, I want to struggle a little. Okay, let them go. One thing, let's say something about them. You notice those women, how often do those women actually meet? All, I want you to look at all those women who say, well, I want that dude making half a million. I want this dude doing that. Just ask them one simple question. Get in the comments, say, hey, where's your man? Seriously. Nah, deal with those women who try and who want some man who's doing some real work, who on his mission, who they want to support his mission. You know? You know, a good woman. That's a good woman. The woman who good for you, good for your program. That's the good woman. That's only... And you know what? Something else. Don't worry about trying to impress the next man. Because the next man deep down jealous of you. So why are you worried about his ass? Worry, worry about the woman. Get with the woman who supports you. All right? Don't try to impress everybody else. That's some bullshit. Okay? That's some bullshit. Get with the woman who down for you. Who gonna make you... Uh, better because of her presence. She trying to support you. She trying to make sure you stay well. Alright? Only focus on the good women. All the rest of them, don't even give them time. Because I'm going to tell y'all something now. All these uh, pages and channels that go in on these women. Deep down, the women. Those women that you're going in on, deep down, getting off on them. Because women get off on attention. Even if it's negative attention. You leave them alone. Because the one thing I've seen in life that will really mess with some of the bad women, when you act like you don't give a shit, boom. Like, I tell you a story. I remember there was this woman. This was way back in the day. She told me, she looked me in the eye and said, you know what, I don't like you. And I just looked at her and just said, okay, we should stay out of each other's way. And left it at that. I found out late she was pissed off. I ain't give a fuck. That, like, gave her her distance. She got back to me. She she fuck with her head. Then I, I didn't give a fuck. That's how you got to be. Focus on the good ones. Focus on the ones. And you know what? Nah, they might not be that, um, you know, that social media baddie, but that's rare anyway. Because if you, hey, let's be real. Y'all know I'll talk about sex. The pussy about the same anyway. Or really better when the woman down for you. And then what she doing otherwise is better for you. All right? So, anyway. Yeah. Uncle Rom still ain't all the way back, but I had to get, I had to be raw with that shit. Too many men, look, here's the thing, fellas. It's too many of y'all working hard, y'all trying to get y'all degrees, y'all certifications, y'all getting y'all businesses together, y'all doing all y'all stuff. Y'all don't need no knucklehead ass woman in your damn circle. Only deal with the women, not even just for romance, just friends, because I'm one of those guys, I say ain't nothing wrong with having some female friends. Have the women in your circle down for you. All right? It's just that simple. All right? So anyway, that's all I have for right now. Like I said, I ain't going to be doing them every day because I'm, I'm, I'm still getting well. But you know what? I still got support, especially uh, Miss Mocha Angel. I still got support getting better. So, you know, that's all that matters. So anyway, I'm going to give y'all some every few days and stuff because I want y'all to keep rising too. And especially any of my... Uh, and the young men, older men, men period, men globally, who going through some of the same things. A lot of guys hit me up and say they've been through a stroke or they going through some stuff. Hey, man, let's all rise together. And then if you're not going through it, keeping your health up and everything else, man. But keep the women in your circle right. Don't, 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 don't have that negative energy. Don't even think about it. Once a woman shows she got some negative energy, be like, damn, you had a fat ass too. Oh, well, bye. All right. So anyway, that's all I got for today, y'all. I'll get back with y'all. Peace and blessings.